Hi, beautiful. <laughs> How you doing? You look fabulous, gorgeous, amazing, stunning, extravagant. Um, let me look up synonyms for um, stunning. Um, hold on, wait one second. <laughs> Remarkable, extraordinary, staggering, incredible, impressive, outstanding, amazing, astonishing, marvelous, phenomenal, splendid, imposing, breathtaking, thrilling, mind-boggling, mind-blowing, out of this world, fabulous, fab, super fantastic, tremendous, wondrous, beautiful, handsome, um, attractive, lovely, good-looking, pretty, sexy, sensational, radiant, ravishing, wonderful, magnificent, glorious, captivating. You're all of those things, and that's just to name a few things, but thank you for being here. I hope I can supply you with some fabulous entertainment for today with some rainbow hair. It is one of my favorite things. Okay, anything colorful is really my favorite. I mean, color makes people happy. It's a known fact. There's this one video that we're gonna start with that you guys have sent to me a million times and it is... <laughs> Breathtaking from the thumbnail, and I cannot wait to watch it with you. There's just a lot of rainbowness going on. People are not scared to color their hair. Insane amounts of colors all at once, and I am so here for that. So I think we're gonna see a lot of great things happen today. I don't think anything really bad is gonna happen, however we'll see. All this is done by, by themselves, um, DIY, and it's all rainbow. So let's watch some people color their hair rainbow and get fully transformed. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, our first video is one that you guys have sent to me a million times, and I've been dying to watch it. It's by a a a Aka, or AKA uh, Aislinn, butched that, butched, botched, I don't know what I did with that. But uh, it's called Dying My Hair Rainbow, again. Hey guys, it's Aislinn, and it's Whoa! Video. We are going to be dying my hair. Wow, that is makeup, honey. That is, <laughs> I want that definitely on my, um, my eyes, I want that in my, on uh, my eyes. I do, I really want that on my eyes. So I'm um, just starting out the video with already an amazing look. I basically stripped all the color out of my hair and removed all of it. So that way I have this nice clean base. The blonde she's starting with is stunning. It's so even <laughs> perfect. I actually think this girl's a hairstylist, so makes sense. Her hair looks stunning. Um, it looks healthy, full of life. And um, it looks like she has like these yellow streaks going on in the middle of her blonde hair, which is quite interesting. Her hair is beautiful. I don't know how she got all the color out. It looks great. So today I'm very excited because this type of rainbow I have never seen anybody else do before. I'm going to be doing split dye rainbow. So my head's going to be rainbow, but each side is going to be a different pattern. When I started doing my hair rainbow, I started out doing that's interesting, rainbow and I loved it, and I'll go back to that eventually. And then recently, as you guys saw, I did like vertical rainbow. And uh -huh. it was the Jawbreaker Technique by Casey. This half of my head is going to be Ombre Rainbow. And then this half of my head is going to be the Jawbreaker Technique again. I'm not familiar with the Jawbreaker Technique, but I think that she's saying she's doing horizontal rainbow on one side and vertical on the other side. Except I don't really know what's going on yet. We'll see. I don't know how this is going to turn out because I could not find any pictures of anybody who had done anything like Originality. this. Originality. I love split dye and I love rainbow hair, so I'm going to combine the two today. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump into the sectioning of my hair and mixing up color. I'm going to be using the exact same colors as I used last time. I'll still show you the colors as I'm mixing them in case you have not seen that last video. For my pink, I'll be using Virgin Pink by Arctic Fox. I've never used Arctic Fox before, but I'm interested. Arctic Fox, let's do a thing. Yeah, I actually really would love to use Arctic Fox. For my orange, I'll be using a combination of Sunset Orange and Porange. Wow. For the yellow, I'll be using a combination of This is exciting. Sunshine. Exciting. For the green, I will be using iris green as well as some neon moon. Yo, this shit's gonna be For mad blue, bright. I'm using aquamarine and I'm going to dilute it with the Arctic Mist diluter. For my purple shade, I will be using purple rain, violet dream, and I'm going to dilute it with the Arctic Mist diluter. All right, so I have this side section. I'm gonna go ahead and start applying the <laughs> Yo, color. there's so I many colors going on. I also have to wipe off my hands in between each color, so that way I don't cross contaminate all the colors. This is about to be so much work and so so much precise work. I don't know how people do it, man. I really don't know how they do it to their own head. I mean, the amount of time and trying to see the back of your head is quite impossible. I'm thrilled to see how this comes out. I feel like I could not do this to myself. No, you know what? I could not do this to myself unless I had a lot of experience doing my own hair. Maybe she does, but shit, man, it's hard. I've seen people cut their own hair actually. And I'm like, why are you doing that? If you can do it, why even do it? It's just a lot of work. She's taking vertical slices 
slices down her head uh, and painting each streak a different color. It looks like she's gonna go all the way down the rainbow and then start over again probably. Boy oh boy, this is satisfying to watch, especially on a black background and she's matching each of her hair dyeing paintbrushes to the color she's doing and I'm like, yes, this is exactly what I want. Like precision and fun at the same damn time. Time. The queen of rainbow here. Whoa, that green is wild. The thing is like I love having blonde hair except like some days of the week I really want colored hair, but like that just can't happen. Maybe I'll have to come up with some product that allows you to do that. This is so fun. I mean this girl has a lot of experience and a lot of planning with this clearly because these are like the perfect rainbow colors in my opinion. This is like when you think of a rainbow, these are the colors you think of and they are flawless. I'm deeply in love with this already and I haven't even seen the outcome yet. So who knows what will happen when I see the outcome. We can only guess that I will have a severe uh, spasm and a good one. In the mirror and she's filming at the same time. Dude, that's impressive. Oh my God. I've tried this before, okay? In the mirror shit and I'm like, I'm still like, oh wait, this is backwards. Like, wait, this is not, this is, I don't know where, what am I painting? Cause my hand's backwards. My mind just doesn't work like that. My mind is powerful, but it is not that powerful. She has the mind of a mind Bender. And Arctic Fox seems to be really saturating her hair without a ton of work. I've noticed a lot of heavy conditioning hair color, demi permanent hair color formulas are very hard to distribute throughout the hair strands because they are not liquidy at all. So wherever you put them, they kind of just end up staying there. And here, it, it kind of seems like it's more of a hybrid between like liquid color and a conditioning color, which I really enjoy. And if I was formulating my own brand's color, I would definitely most likely do something like that. Okay, now she's doing on the other side, she's doing a vertical ombre with all the different colors. Again, this girl has patience. This is so satisfying to watch. Keep going, girl. You got this, 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 keep going. I would be done. I think that I just don't have patience. Actually, I don't think that I don't have patience. I definitely don't have patience. So like me getting my hair cut for 30 minutes, I actually want to crawl out of the chair and die. Like I just don't want to do it anymore. It's official. This is going to be the most epic rainbow hair color I've ever seen in my life. What? All right, guys. So I got everything applied. Honestly, that was so difficult. Yeah. This side was easy. This side was a pain in my butt. It was so hard to like blend all the colors and do it section by section. It was awful. Yeah. I'm hoping everything turns out okay. I'm going to rinse it out with ice cold water. I'm not gonna shampoo or condition or anything. I'm just gonna rinse it out with really cold water. Just to let you guys know, when you're using any permanent color, conditioning color, anything like that, um, like Arctic Fox or Overtone or anything, uh, Manic Panic, I never shampoo. You don't even need to shampoo out permanent color. You can actually just heavily rinse it. I'm 99% sure that all color manufacturers recommend that you don't shampoo it out. Most of us do, and it's not necessary at all, and actually makes your color not last as long. Rinse it until it goes clear, and you should be all set. So I'd actually recommend not shampooing it. Okay guys, so I'm back. Everything turned out what? really well. This side, Dude. I thought it was gonna be patchy, but it's not at all. It's even and everything. So I just wanted to hop on here and show you guys what it looks like straight. I just yes. it. I know some of you guys are gonna want to see it straight. Some are I want to see it curly. See curly. So yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and curl it real quick. Okay, so I just curled my hair, and here is how it looks curled. I like it better curled, just like this sis. blends in together. Better. Get up. And yeah, I love it. I think it's really cool. I've never seen anyone with it before, and. Amazing and I hope you keep this hair color forever and you literally die with it on your head like this I want you in the casket with rainbow hair color. Is that gore? It, it's Halloween. I don't it's fine. Um, it looks really good I think this is my favorite hair that I've ever done. It just looks so nice and everything blends together yeah. That is all I have for today's video guys. Leave a comment down below letting me know which side you like better I like both. I want both I don't want to have to choose and I don't want to choose and I'm not going to choose and it looks amazing Plus she just did an absolutely fabulous job with the color like honestly like that was way too precise not to be a hairstylist Next video is by Love Lady Lux. It's called Rainbow Hair Tutorial featuring Arctic Fox Okay, Arctic Fox again. Let's see how it works for her and the starting picture seems like we're gonna have a very dramatic outcome Hi guys, it's Sharon from Love Lady Lux. Welcome back hey, to girl. my channel Welcome so, back to my channel awesome. And you can probably tell by the title. I'm gonna comb my hair today. 
I'm pretty excited about it because it's about seven and a half months since I put color in my hair and I'm gonna do something different today because why not? I'm trying to mix it up a little bit every single time I do one of these videos because you guys don't want to see the same thing over and over again. Yo, I need these Arctic Fox color bowls to be honest with you. Like, matching my color to the brush and the bowl is so so satisfying. Again, I think we're doing like full on rainbow like the other girl did and we're doing the same kind of color sitch. This is so satisfying. <laughs> what is it about rainbows that just makes me the happiest ever? Just makes me just feel like I am in a rainbow Barbie world. Okay, so now she's showing us what she's going to do as her pattern. Um, something like a pink, purple, blue, green, yellow, uh, orange, and red, sorry. That's a and, lot. Uh, let's just into it. Yo, she is not even scared. She's like, I'm just gonna like put this on my head and just we're we're gonna go a completely different color. It's gonna be amazing. She is really doing a damn thing. Oh hell yes! <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love that pink. It's like very cool tone. Very pretty. Very 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 sexy. And then we get the violet going on. We get a little green in there. We get a little yellow in there. I want to see it all. I don't want you to skimp on the colors. I want you to go in there and give me everything you ever thought of giving me because I'm here and I want to see some good shit. Now we're doing the green and the yellow. Yay! Another thing with rainbow situations like this, if you're gonna do it yourself, which you can, go ahead. Listen, I am an advocate of doing your own demi-permanent color because demi-permanent obviously means it's not permanent and it is not going to mess up your cuticle. It is not going in there and changing construction of the cortex of your hair, which is what permanent color does. Anything with ammonia, anything with peroxide involved, it's going to change the actual chemical makeup of your hair follicle. That don't do it unless you literally um, know exactly what you're doing, um, which you can. I mean, listen, my channel isn't exactly about you not doing anything at home. It's about you not doing it at home incorrectly. Um, and the reason why I always say just go to a hairstyle is because 90% of people don't know how to do hair. For that small percentage of that people that do, please go ahead. Have fun, do your own hair. Or if you just don't care about up your hair, do it yourself. Listen, I've done a lot of shit to my hair and I've messed it up a lot of times myself. It's fun sometimes, I get it. As a professional, I think we all just say, go to a hairstylist because it's the easiest thing to do and to get it done right. Uh, but to any permanent color, what I was saying is uh, I definitely advocate you doing that yourself. I mean, if you're gonna do something colorful like this, do it yourself. It's pretty easy. There are so many different color lines out there you can buy online or get at Sally's um, that will do the trick for you, like Arctic Fox or overtone or manic panic. It's something that I do say that you could do at home because it's not gonna ruin your hair and usually it's gonna make it feel softer and better. But please, if you're gonna try and do any rainbow colors or any fashion colors, start off with a great canvas. Don't have any yellows or orange or anything present in your hair before you color it or else you're going to not get the desired color you're looking for. Say if you have orange hair and you're trying to color it blue, you put blue over that orange hair, it's pretty much just gonna cancel each other out and create probably like a little, like a grayish tone or like gray, slightly blue tone because you don't have the proper base to start with and blue and orange together don't mix. So just make sure you start off like something like this where she had kind of a silver tone to start with. Um, you can pre-color your hair uh, to get it started for the coloring process and use a purple shampoo before your coloring process in order to get it to that base level of like a light silver in order to get these colors to pop and be the most vibrant possible little tip okay guys so oh this is the completed look i'm so happy with the way that my hair turned out uh, this is definitely not new it was a very big feat for me i was a little bit stressed about doing it what this looks incredible it like makes her skin pop and makes her look healthy and glowy and so fun and fresh and young and I am obsessed with it. I think she looks incredible with this hair. I love that kind of green part um, going through uh, the yellow and green. It's so pretty and she looks stunning. Again, grade A color job too. I'm really proud of myself that anytime I take on something new as far as a challenge for my hair or really take on a challenge for anything, I'm able to succeed, which is really self-motivating. Um, and I'm really, I really, I think it's really beautiful the way it turned out. I went to brunch already this morning and I already got compliments. Everywhere you go, you're gonna get compliments everywhere. And I love that she said, you know, trying something new um, and succeeding gives you a lot of self-confidence and um, it's always important to push yourself and make yourself super uncomfortable. That is what life is about in my opinion. I am constantly making myself 
impossibly uncomfortable. And after I do that thing that makes me uncomfortable, like public speaking, say, or like speaking to a crowd of people, I would get the major high after and I feel so good about it. So you guys go out in life and try something new. Um, you won't regret it. Even if it makes you so nervous and so scared to the point you're shaking, um, you'll get through it. Do some meditation and some breathing. You'll get through it and you'll be high as hell after, naturally. All right, all right, I was gonna end it there, but let's just watch one more. This is by Mia March and it looks pretty epic. So why not just, let's speed through this one and just watch one more. Wow. Okay, so we're starting off blonde again. This is major. They're going full on, baby. They're going layer by layer. Mixing up that color again. Got some beautiful colors going there. Okay, so they're going horizontal through the head. This is gonna be really interesting, having like shelves of color instead of vertically. We're doing a bunch of horizontal lines, it looks like. Starting off with a great base color enough to make all the colors really pop. Oh, she's doing a little ombre moment too. Okay, I see you. It's, it is a really big change. It's pretty wild. And to wake up every day with rainbow hair is a commitment. Like, it's a little scary. I haven't had quite rainbow hair, but I've had pretty much every color in the world. Um, but uh, waking up with like, you know, really bright colored hair is like, you are, am I looking at the same person in the mirror that I am in real life, is that me? You know what I mean? Like it's really kind of scary sometimes. <sighs> She's going in. <laughs> I wonder how it's gonna look cause it's gonna be like parted and then the layer on top will be blue and then everything underneath will kind of shine through. I wonder if this girl's ever done anything like this before cause this is quite the damn change for her. You know me, you know that I love change. You know that I love changing things up. Changing things up is how you move forward. It's about time that I change it up. We'll see what happens in the near future, but I wanna see the outcome. No, I really do. I'm not saying anything yet. Oh my God. Wait, the girl doing her hair has sickening hair too. <laughs> I love that. Mm, okay. Do these girls wake up at 5 a.m. to do their hair and makeup? Like they look stunning. <sighs> is this gonna look good? <laughs> Okay, there we go. Oh my God, she looks amazing. Dude, she looks amazing and her skin is glowing. Like something about rainbows really makes people's skin glow. Well, that makes sense. It's cause like it brings out every different tone in your skin and kind of makes you feel very like vibrant and cute. I want to flat iron her hair. Oh. <laughs> this is too much for me. Dude, she looks so good. Oh my God, this is so pretty. This is probably the coolest. I love the way the top is blue and everything underneath kind of shines through. We just saw like three different applications of doing rainbow hair and all of them were super creative and super cool. I love this, she looks so good. Maya, yes, yes, keep this. <sighs> I hope that inspired you to maybe change your hair, maybe take a risk and do something crazy because that was incredible and stunning and they looked Beautiful. Anyways, other than that, that's all for today. Make sure you guys check me out on Instagram and Twitter at Brown uh, my hair care brand X Mondo Hair. Shop my new shampoo and conditioner, Project X. And you can shop Glitterati Styling Serum, the classic, the beautiful, the original Glitterati at xmondohair.com. Link below. Oh, and we just got Afterpay. So if you do not have the money now, uh, you can pay in four installments instead of paying all together. I know a lot of you guys were asking for that. So I just want to let you know that we finally have Afterpay. Woo! on xmonohair.com and you'll see it at checkout. If you'd like to have beautiful hair now and pay for it later, you now can. You're welcome. Check out my channel with my brother, Brad and Eric, where we'll be uploading new videos in a bit, but you can watch the current ones that we have on the channel now. And that is all for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life. And I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>